ya inakuwaje mtu wangu kama kawa ni RT mtu mzima au sio na siku ya leo mtu wangu niko na Pedro Blex ndani ya nyumba mtu wangu tegia tukichapa story mbili tatu au sio inakuwaje bro fresh sana ya vipi life man Simba tunangana tu hivyo hivyo. Pedro Blex mwenyewe. Yeah, Pedro Blex dance artist, baddest kid on the planet that. Oh, yeah. see you. Yeah. All the way from Jamaica. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's not like that. Si hivyo yani ni ile tu accent sema tu muziki tu ndio hivyo lazima tuwe hivyo yani. Mm. Tume grow up tukisikiza hiyo sala lazima tuwe na hivyo yani. Yeah. Kwa hivyo hebu tuelezee kwanza your asili yako yani your originality. Wow. Natokea wapi bro? Kwa sababu watu wengi wanashinda huyu jamani ni Jamaica ama ni Mkenya? Oh, mimi ni Mkenya, mimi ni Mkenya. Okay, mimi ni Mkenya. Honestly, mimi ni Mkenya lakini mimi ni mimi I'm from Kisumu. Mimi ni mimi natoka Kisumu. Asili yangu mimi Kisumu. Mi, oh, yeah. Jadong. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, kitu kama hiyo oh, mimi ni Jaluo. I'm a proud, yeah. I'm a proud yeah. little there. Yeah. yeah. Na iwe ujaluo ndiyo sababu ya kuwa unafanya ngoma zako kwa kimomo mpo sana? Uh, tuseme ujaluo, ujua ujaluo na kiswaili ni kama... Not, yani, Mokuta na maji. Ya, yeah, kitu kama hiyo. Yani, <laughs> Havipatani. Ya, yeah, havipatani. So, when you see a luo, trying to do kiswaili, respect that person. No, no, yashimu sana o mtu. Hmm. So, dance hall, tuseme iyo kiswaili, iyo nime, nime zaliwa, minka wana skiza dance hall. Awesome. No, no. So hivyo tu ndo nime kwa hivyo tu nimejua. Kwa hivyo in short Pedro Blex is a luo. Pedro Blex is a luo from Kisumu. Au oh, sio. Yeah. Na ukiangalia ngoma zako nyingi mm. ziko na ladha ya kijamaika sana. Sijui hii accent uliitoa wapi? Uh, mimi nime grow up nikimsikiza Red Sun. Mm. Nime grow up sana nikisikiza Wire, nime grow Moso Red Sun mm. ama nime grow up ya nikisikiza um, Sema vibes cartel. So nikika na jaribu ku nikifanya mziki nasikia tu ile accent lazima iko kwa tu kwa damu yani na flow. So lazima nasikia najipata tu naimba hivyo tu. Yaani ni need a passion. Yeah. Na kwa nini ukaamua kuja na stand ya ya dance hall? Mm hasa mimi nikiwa Nairobi, Nairobi kuna genus so many genus of music, unaona? Kila mtu yemba style yake. Hasa mimi nikifika hapa Malindi naona hakuna mtu yoimba this kind of music. Kila mtu ako kama niseme kama ngombe wote wameka kwa zizi moja. So mimi nadhaga ni unique. Hakuna mtu, hakuna mtu in the coastal region uwezi pata mtu yemba dance la mesmama na dance la nobody. Yaani kwa hiyo watu nikapuka. Yeah. Hii muziki mwingine zingine. benga zuku yeah. na kadhalika. Hakuna hakuna mwingine. So kwa hivyo uliamua kuja unique. Yeah. How's it? In life you have to be unique. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, na I'm very sure haujalala haujalala siku moja ukaamka tarehe ukasema acha niwe msanii. Kuna vitu fulani <laughs> zenye zilitokea ndio maana ukaamua kuwa msanii. Si ni kweli? Yeah. Ni vitu gani? Ni kitu gani kilikuinspire kuwa msanii? Mimi niki sema nikikuwa mimi nilikuwa na nilikuwa dadangu alikuwa kuna sema pale ambapo watu walikuwa wananunua CD hizi za ngoma. So kika pale unasikia ngoma 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 hizi ngoma za kitambo kina Chameleon, Red Sun. So unapata kila siku unaenda pale natoka shule na kimbia pale. Then I just listen to the all those stuff. Then I said no. I can also create my own stuff. Then nikaanza kutengeneza ngoma. Ngoma ni nitengeza nikiwa primary nikaja ndio ikawa ngoma yangu ya kwanza. Nina nilifanya kaka empire. Kaka empire ngoma yeah. yako ya kwanza. Ilikuwa yeah. lini? Ilikuwa 2019. 2019. Ngoma yangu ya kwanza Nairobi. Na unekumbuka lyrics paka sign? Yeah. Hebu tudokeze kidogo. We gonna prove them we know how to dance. We gonna show them we know how to rap. We gonna show them we know how to dance. Now dance 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 shike bam bam shike bam bam say on the dance floor on the dance floor prove them dance for them sing for them that's kid come in. Sasa project yako ya kwanza ulifanyia kwa King Kaka Empire. Yeah nilifanya kwa King Kaka Kaka Empire Studios uh, produced by Jack on the Beat. You know that person you are producer by that time alikuwa mkali ukisikia Jack Jack but, on the beat and then nasikia tu already na kwa hit na beat sasa vile ilikuwa ni experience yako ya kwanza kabisa kuingia kwa studio na ukaenda kwa label kubwa kama hiyo ilikuwaaje experience yako yeah ilikuwa awesome na pia nasema nasema tu ni 
Osa ni tunapitia changamoto nyingi. Ono ukienda studio kama ile, so kila kitu itakuwa fresh tu yani. So hiyo ni kama ni kama kama fuzo kwangu. As a lesson to me that ukia si atu kienda studio kubwa, imanishi kwamba tayari umekuwa ume make it. No. Kwa hivyo ilikuwa experience nzuri kwako. Kwa. Yeah, ilinifunza kwamba anahitaji kukua patience. Yeah, I need to be patient ndo nifike pale ambapo mimi nataka kufika. Kwa hivyo. Yeah. Na baada ya kutoka Kakempa ya mm. ufanya project yako ya kwanza mm -hmm. Project zingine ambao zilifata ni gani? E, nilifika Malindi then, nika, then I decided to quit music Nika sema music is not gonna pay me mm. Let me focus on something else Then nika fanya ngoma Ene to dig it in featuring Madi Techno But they share out to Madi Techno Nilikuwa ni meacha mziki then haka nifata So that music recently I re-uploaded it so on my YouTube channel. Yeah. Chako. Yeah, akasema bro niandike ngoma, niende studio. Nikasema no, wacha niandike nikuandikie then na mimi niandike part yangu. Yeah. yeah. So mkafanyia project ya kwanza mali. Yeah. Kwa studio gani? Mm, Pillar Works Music. Yeah. Pillar Works. Pillar Works Music. Okay. Mm. Na kuna hizi ngoma kadhaa ambazo ushawe kufanya. Kuna mm. kama Iyo ambao umetajwa umefanya na Madi Techno. Yeah, Madi Techno. Kuna ingino ulifanya na King D, mm. ila yeye. Mm. Na kata ambazo, ambazo ulizitoa. So, mm. kufikia sayu kuna ngoma kato kwa jini? Mm, kufikia sayu nina kama ngoma nane hivi. Ngoma nane, yu ni full album bro. Yeah, yeah amazing ya. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. It's a great journey. Mkiatu album? Bado. Oh. Sijafikia hapo. Kata kato album ufikia ngoma tati bro. I know, you are saying Malindi, watch it to honest. Music is not that paying well, you know. Same true is is not that paying totally. So if you invest your money on an album, album my friend, you're losing. Hakuna kitu chapati. Utakuwa stressed up, then you, music is full of stress. Okay, to album now. Toyo kidogo kidogo, then evil too. Itafika wakati wake wa album. Na kuna temu ni leona umepost. Hmm kwa Facebook kwa umeacha mziki. Mm. I hope ilikuwa tu last week. Yeah. Yeah. Ni kiki ulikuwa unatafuta ama ni kweli umeacha mziki? <laughs> Mimi nilikuwa na mimi nilikuwa natamani sana kuacha mziki. Mm. Sababu nilikuwa na time. Time yangu na mziki inakuwa job, alafu mziki, alafu inakuwa sisi manage vitu viwili. Tofauti kila mtu uwezi panda farasi wawili, alafu tarajie utarai mbele, no. It's, it's gonna be very difficult, Nona. So, Nkasema, wacha niache. So, some of my close friends, it was after I uploaded my song on YouTube, then one of my close friends was going report, then I was going to report on YouTube. They reported the video for you? Yeah, yeah. So, I got very angry, then Nkasema, wacha niache mziki. Then, mtu wakaji akanembea, basi take a break. At least to jena something. Kwani hii video ambo ili, ili reportiwa pake kafuto, kwani ilikuwa inazumumzia nini ama ilikuwa niko vipi? Mm, sema tu ilikuwa, 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 ilikuwa video ngoma nyingine, nilikuwa, nilikuwa napango kutuwa EP, mm. then sasa hiyo ngoma ilikuwa netuwa Ungrateful Souls. Mm. Ilikuwa tu ile na, nasema wala mbo mimi ni mawe wa shika mkono kuwaleta labda kwenye game, ama ni mawe wa saidia na mnaive ama nyingine. Then wana wanaenda hapo wana wanageuka wana kuwa so ungrateful wana wanasema vibaya so no na kitu kama hiyo so ika nikaandika hivyo so nadhani ili wafikia ndo wakaamua kuitoa kwa hivyo ni kama kalikuwa kabifu plan mhm mm mhm mm yeah lakini mziki bado uko kwa game um, for now to say me niko kwa game lakini niko kwa break i'm on a break okay. yeah likizo kidogo <laughs> yeah likizo kidogo <laughs> nitulizaki like ile kidogo eh mm. likizo yako ite 20 mhm very soon sababu kuna projects mingi kuna collaborations fla, kadha nime kuna mse tuko Nairobi amenita anapenda ile dance all vibe so anataka ni ni, ni hype ya nini mfanyie kama tuseme mtu yo imba yeah. then ni mfanyie kama wala nsheta sidong what me I do this yani you hype so ana, anapenda anapenda vile nafanya hata king d aliniita honestly nifanye kitu kama hiyo but le, nikaja nikampatia kora singine nzuri akafurahia akasema tuimbe sasa tuache hiyo kitu kama hiyo unaona yeah. na vile wewe unaimba dance hall mm. na umekuja coast ukapata uka, uka coast watu wa wembi dance hall mm. 
ngoma zako zinapokelewa vipi of course mm, mitaani ngoma zangu zapokelewa mimi naweza tembea mali fulani mtu anasema ah Pedro Blex mkali yule anaweza lakini ukienda kwa redio ni utapata ichezi sababu pale kuna wale ambao wameshika wasanii fulani wanasema wao ni wasanii wangu sasa ukienda pale kwa radio station yeah. wanakata pale wanasema chezesha hawa usichezeshe hawa lakini wangu. yeah in real sense kuna wale wasanii ambao wana uwezo zaidi ya wale pale right. sasa radio ni wanachezwa lakini mitaani hawajulikani na wewe shauri kuzipeleka yeah. ngoma zako kwa radio station hapa coast so mara moja so mara pili mara nyingi Ama sana kesi ni vile vile wanasema yeah wanasema hatuwezi chezesha ngoma za Kiswahili hapa tunacheza I mean hatuwezi cheza ngoma za kijamii kama kizungu hapa tuchezesha Kiswahili tu Yeah. <laughs> Bado nanikumbusha posti ambayo uliachilia kidogo kama nafikiri ilikuwa April mm. ya kusema kuwa radio station nyingine mm. ukipeleka ngoma zako azichezwe anasema anataka ngoma za Kiswahili. Mm. Sijui ilikuwa na maanisha nini ama ilikuwa na maanisha nini kwa hiyo posti. Unajua kuna kitu liniuma sana by then. Sometimes unajua mimi huwa napenda kusema tu kitu kweli so when someone decides to hate me then let them go ahead and ahead and hate me. Yeah. Mimi nafanya ngoma sio. Nili collaborate na wasani fulani. Tukofanya ilikuwa flavor fulani, gingeton plus dance la dance artist. So tukaleta flavor hiyo pamoja. Ah nikapeleka wakasema hatuwezi. Msana fulani akaenda akafanya collab na Reckless kule yeah. I think. Uh-huh. Akapeleka. Sisi si tunamchukia no. Dance She's like my sister. Unaona? No. Yeye yeah, yomba Kiswahili, Reckless yomba gingeton. Gingeton. Unaona? Yeah akapeleka na yachezwa mpaka ya interview. So naona ni kama kuna ubaguzi fulani yani. Yeah, kitu kama hiyo. So ina Sasa umeona sababu kubwa ni nini? Hiyo ubaguzi wote na sababu ya nini? Mm. Yaweza kuwa, yaweza kuwa kuna vile wanaitisha fedha kidogo labda na hawajaniambia. Ama yaweza kuwa tu ni watu fulani wana umemu kwa favor. Do usijua. Usijua bro. Yeah. You got it tangu kujia kukosusha waitwa kwa radio station yote kufanya interview. Mm. Wakiniona wananisalimia. Hata leo nilikuwa na one of them wakiniona wananisalimia nikiwa mbali wananisalimia yo 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 Pedro. Yeah. But nikiwa peleke ngoma. Yeah imeshia hapo hivyo. Wow. Yeah. Na sasa hizo ni challenge ambazo unapitia una sasa huko coast. Mm. Ume target kuzitackle vipi? Eh sasa kitu ndo one of the reasons as to why I'm taking a break cuz nataka ni come na I want to come differently I want to with come back idea. yeah with, with a new idea nataka kujaribu it's like uh, testing waters unajaribu gani tamu gani so nataka kukuja in different way tuone kama how will fans my fans react to this one no no yeah kitu kama hiyo wow. ni vizuri na na pengine nikuulize kidogo swali la uchokozi. Mm. Je, uko na mpenzi? Mhm. Wa, hii nikisema itaniharibia mambo mengi sana. Hapa <laughs> hayuko peke yake. Mhm. Ki vipi hayuko? Utaki utaki asikie ukimtaja. Ah, sivyo, sivyo. <laughs> yuko, yuko. Mimi yuko. 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 Ya. Yeah. Yuko lakini yuko mbali kidogo ana ka Nairobi by now ya. Ya vizuri. Na sai tuko time ya corona mm. show hakuna because mm. uh, your last show kuiona ilikuwa mm. wakati umeitwa na Njita. Ya Njita. Na sai sijaona kufanya show nyingine tena. Ah mm. kuna endelea nini ama umejipanga vipi? Show 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 ziko nimeitwa kadhaa lakini sasa bro kitwa show naambiwa unatafuta jina then unajiuliza how is kutafuta jina how how is, how is kutafuta jina going to help me how is it going to pay my rent unajua yeah. tunafanya mziki sisi kukudanganya mimi nafanya mziki ile one day mziki unilipe yeah yeah, yeah. commercial music yeah i'm doing it for money oh call it anyway hali mziki ukulipe au fine Uh, sitaki kufanya. Sasa kama ni show unaambiwa free then inauma bro, inauma sana. Inauma. Yeah. yeah but I'm very sure siku zijazo kuna target ambazo uko na plans zako ambazo umeweka ili upande, ufanye kazi vile unataka. 
Ya kuna plans, kuna plans nimeweka lakini sasa tutasubiri tu muda muda mafaka yani the right time ikifika then yeah. Yeah. Na kwa dakika moja unaweza kuzungumziaje muziki wa Malindi? Mm. Ese muziki wa Malindi. Mm. Muziki wa Malindi kwa sasa huwezi kuwa. Mm. Okay. Sababu yani haukuu ya huwezi ya kuwa sababu yani kuna uwezi uwezi pata watu kila mtu anapaka imbe the same kind of music the same type of music alafu unatarajia muziki ukue alafu unatarajia tu kuwe competition na labda wasi wa nje Nairobi maybe so haezi kuwa sababu watu tachoka na the same style of music yeah huwezi mpa mtoto chakula kimoja alafu tarajia ridhike no lazima mpe tofauti tofauti ukiwa na sasa hivi ndo nasema muziki wa madini ni kama style moja Ni stali gani wa wanaimba? Ni stali moja wa Malindi wanajaribu kuimba zile visuali za Tanzania. Kila mtu anataka imbe sababu wanaona zile zina trend. Zinashika. Na wale nao wanataka uimbe kizungu ndo ngoma zao zipande. Sisi tunataka tuimbe viswahili. Mhm. Uh -huh. So naona. So kwa hivyo ni kama unapata mtu ametumia kivocha fulani ashatumia is used to vocha then atupe chini wewe unataka hiyo kote hiyo kote itumie hiyo eh no haiwezi eh mfano hatari kwa yeah something like that ni kitu gani ambao ifanywe malindi ndio hakiche muziki wa malindi umesonga radio station through your experience yeah. yeah through my experience radio station nao watu ambao wanajiona wamechukua wa wasanii kadha kadha stakeholders ya yeah, yeah, kitu kama hiyo wachukue kila mtu kila msanii wamchukue wamshike mkono so lazima awe anaimba kizungu anaimba rap anaimba nini wachukue kila mtu waweke pamoja wafanye kitu kimoja alafu the thing another thing is sponsors kama kuna mtu ambaye anaweza tokelezea sponsor msanii then itakuwa fresh na mm. Yeah. Na ungependa kumwambia nini fani wako? Mm, fani wangu Yo, my people Pedro Blex is actually on a, a, a little break, so I'm kind of rebranding. Na very soon I'm going to come up with a new a new stuff and I hope you all going to like it. Kama nataka tuimbe Kiswahili, tutaimba Kiswahili wa watu wone reaction zao. Naambie Hakuna mtu atakuwa kama Pedro Blex. Hakuna mtu anaweza kuimba dance kama Pedro Blex. Kwa kwa hivyo I am unique. Wasiwadanganye hivi nini. No. Pedro Blex is always gonna be Pedro Blex. I'm not gonna change. Dance all for shine, dance all forever. Yeah. Au sio. Mm. Na tukimalizia. Mm. Mtu akitaka ngoma zako anaweza kazipata wapi? Eh ukitaka ngoma zangu unaenda YouTube Pedro Blex Music utapata ngoma zangu. Yeah. Ya tufungie mchezo na acapella. Okay. Body tight falling I might the girl with the big body big body dancing bikini beat the strolling kuna robot na maga manoti magika magika tingika wala sheta sit body like a cola yeah man yeah boy Pedro Blex representing free girl them. Pedro Blex au sio yeah. all the way from Kisumu now in Malindi. Au sio na amesema kuwa kwa unique yani Hakuna mtu anaweza fanana na yeye. Usikose kufuatilia kila wakati BMTV Kenya kwa habari zaidi mtu wangu. Kwa kwanza kusubscribe au okay.